In my previous video, I demonstrated how you can use the Windows System File Checker tool in Command Prompt or Windows PowerShell to fix Windows files that may have been corrupted or missing. This SFC slash scan now command should go through the process and may come back with a message such as what we have here, which is the Windows Resource Protection did not find any violations. But you may also get messages such as Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files and successfully repaired them. Or in some situation, you may unfortunately get a message saying Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files but was unable to fix some of them. In that situation, you still may be able to use the same SFC slash scan now command. But before you do that, you may need to launch something called the Deployment Image Servicing and Management, also known as DISM. It is a command line tool that can be used to service and prepare Windows images. And this DISM can help fix file system checker failures to fix those corrupt files. So if you end up with that situation where you, know, you run this and the corrupt files are not fixed, and that's when you can use this particular command. So to do that, what you need to do is type dism.exe space slash online space slash clean up dash image slash we're gonna type restore help so this is the command you need to enter i will put this in the description of this video as well so even if you have run the windows updates this is a separate command that you can use from either command prompt or through your windows powershell that still will create that special windows uh, image that may be able to get that uh, some of the files that won't be ab uh, able to fix it uh, using the cfc scan now uh, command previously so after you enter in this you can press enter and it'll take a few minutes to run through this just like before So once you have run the DISM command, uh, you will get this message saying the operation has been completed successfully. And when you have that message, you can now in this command prompt or in the PowerShell rerun the system file checker command, which should be the SFC slash scan now. By doing that, you may be able to fix the files that was not able to fix it previously. While this is not a guaranteed solution, it is another way you can try to fix your corrupt Windows system files without reinstalling the entire operating system. This DISM command will also work on previous Windows versions as well as the server operating systems. Until next time, thank you for watching and have a nice day.